Don't put we, the pressure on. I'm sorry? <laughs> don't put the pressure on. Don't put the, okay. You might not get a great fight. <laughs> no, I might like, totally freeze up. No. no. Hi, Catherine. Hi. Thank you so much for doing this for my video blog, Divine Frame. Thanks for coming and joining us. Please um, tell us a little bit about Lumen and um, your association with Comic Con. Lumen started um, the concept of VIP gifting in the region. We started with Abu Dhabi Film Festival and then brought it to Dubai Film Festival, Formula One, and now Comic Con. We, um, we look for events that have multi days and um, a list of celebrities that are coming so that we, we go to the events and offer to host them and gift them. Um, with products from the region and international products. So that's how we came about with Comic-Con. Here we are expecting Taylor Kitsch, we are expecting Michael J. White, we are expecting um, Giancarlo Esposito from Breaking Bad, um, Sylvester McCoy. So yeah, we have a nice list of, of uh, cool celebrities coming through. We've actually had a really good group of celebrities, I think when they come to this region they're so relaxed because people don't actually bother them. You see the likes of, um, you know, Kate Blanchett and um, Colin Firth walking through the lobby of hotels and walking outside and nobody really bothers them. So we've been very lucky. I would actually say that their publicists are more passive than they are, <laughs> if truth be told. We had, um, we had Uma Thurman a couple of years ago and it was quite funny, they were so concerned with anyone being in the room with her that they were like, we need to clear the room, we need to, it's a great example of how celebrities are so laid back, clear the room, get everybody out. So we put all this group of people out on the terrace who had happened to be in the lounge at the time. She walked right in the lounge and was like, I'm, I'm so exhausted, I just finished this crazy press conference, I need a drink and a cigarette, and walked right outside and hung out with all the people hanging out on the terrace, asked them for a light for her cigarette, so all this concern about no one should talk to Uma Thurman, she was like hanging with peeps, so that's a, that's that's a funny story. So again, shows celebrities are laid back people, they're usually, they're just normal everyday people. Yeah, we have Cotton, we yeah. have, and then we have Tea Junction, Tea Junction and Cotton Candy, two regional designers, they're friends, one does flip-flops, one does t-shirts. We have Speedometer, who's just launched in the region, and they're bracelets made out of the bezel of watches, and actually they've been featured in Vogue already. They're doing very well. We have um, New Era Caps, which we've worked with them in the past with uh, at Formula One with the musical artist, who, um, is, again, a favorite. If you're wearing a cap, it's a New Era Cap, probably. Uh, we have the Box Cinema 3D, 4DX, which is perfect, obviously, for some like a Comic-Con newly launched in the region and um, so everyone will get to try it out. Great and last question um, Catherine, tell us uh, any future plans, are you uh, teaming up with any other huge event in Dubai? We again look to see what's up, yeah Virgin Red Fest has approached mm -hmm. us so we'll see if we can do that next year, um, love to do Dubai duty free tennis so we've We've uh, approached them. So, yeah, looking, you know, again, we'll do diff, we'll do F1 soon. We're looking forward to adding more to the list.